Here are your morning Manchester United headlines on Monday, June 5. Manchester United were dull and devoid of attacking options for an hour at Wembley over the weekend. Then they brought Alejandro Garnacho on. Last season, the 18-year-old lit up the FA Youth Cup final with a magnificent brace that inspired United to victory. A year later, he was needed by the first team to rekindle their spark instead. Garnacho had changed his phone screensaver to a picture of the iconic trophy ahead of the FA Cup final, but that would prove to be the closest head get to it on a day when his side were clearly second best. Few players have experienced a rise so meteoric in such a short space of time, with Garnacho almost effortlessly transitioning from teenage hopeful to senior starlet. Read the decision United must make about Garnacho against the backdrop of a takeover saga that is showing no signs of stopping anytime soon. Eric Ten Hag stepped forward and led by example. Appointed Manchester United's fifth permanent manager since Sir Alex Ferguson's retirement a decade ago, the Dutchman, poached from Ajax in April last year, enjoyed both a fruitful and promising maiden campaign in the Old Trafford dugout. He ended United's six-year wait for a trophy and guided them back into the Champions League at the very first attempt. His main objective at the very beginning of the season was to lead United to a top-four finish and help them reclaim their place in Europe's Premier Club competition for next term. In the end, despite some nervy moments along the way, it was a mission he passed with flying colours. Read the question that United must answer for Ten Hag.